So, we are here at uh, Mai Zhang Dim Sum Place uh, in Canada. So, Gihan eats in Canada, and I have got a special guest, James Marie. Hello. So, this is your first time having Dim Sum, right? It is. So, we got some Dim Sum here, and this is pork and cabbage, or pork and uh, Chinese cabbage. Yeah? So, James, go in, your first Dim Sum. Okay. Can you talk me through what I'm supposed to do here? Because so, what I'll do is I'll, I'll take the first one, so you know. So what I like to do is start off with a little bit of soy. A little bit of chilli. You don't have to add the chilli, but... Uh, that's, I'll try without. That's, that's my jam. I like chilli. And also like a touch of vinegar just to offset the flavour. Mix around a little bit, just so it all goes in. Okay. So, first dim sum. Grab it. Bite without the uh, stuff. And bite with. So. Really good consistency. Soft melts in the mouth. Nice good pork flavour. A little bit of salt. Chinese cabbage offsets it. Gives it a bit of sweetness. Then dip it in for that heat. Mm. I'm a fan. It's good. It's good. I've, I've never been to China, so I don't know what good Chinese dumplings like, but I enjoy that. Take it back. Gentleman James. Right. <laughs> I'll stick with just the sort of sauce. Okay. Okay. There is vinegar, if you wish it. Yeah. yeah. Just a little bit dark. <laughs> Okay. Mix around with the chopsticks a little bit. I have no idea what to expect. That's fine. So, as I said, first bite. I'm not very handy with chopsticks either. Can I just It'll be fine. Out? First bite without, and then the next bite, dip it in, get some of that extra This is not going to go well. I already stab it, stab it then. No, 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 that would be giving up. I'm almost. He's trying, ladies and gentlemen. There. there we go. There we go. Right. Oh, that was very interesting. How do you feel about it? Good. Good. That's all I can say at this, at this mm -hmm. juncture. And with the extra dip? Good stuff. Thank you very much. We've got some more. I believe this is our beef curry and onion. Do you want to try that? That was, that was very nice. I've always likened dumplings to a Chinese sausage roll. I like, I like how you're thinking that. But go in on the beef dumpling one. Give it a try. Give your impressions, your flavour profile. Just stab it, it'll be fine. Oh, okay. Just do, just I do feel it. like such a cultural knot. It's fine. Oh, my God. That attacked me. In a good way. Oh. Looking good. Thank you. We've got our uh, fried pork and shrimp ones. Tell us about the beef and onion. Oh, he's enjoying that's, it. No, that's quite hot. I had to rush that one. Okay. Uh, but despite that, that was that was even better. I like that. What about? The pork and shrimp one, go in. No, no, can we do this off? I need to, on, I need to have a private moment with at least some of my food. Can okay. We... I'll tell you what, switch it over, I'll take over and do those ones. So, we're going to go for the beef curry one first. That was that one, wasn't it? Mm. It was. Yeah. Well, I'm not doing well here. Alright, let's try again. The thing about that one, it's a very neutral flavour, so you can take on the flavour of the soy, the chilli, the vinegar, as you want it. This one, however, I'm a little bit concerned about the, after James's reaction. 
Mm. It tastes of curry powder. I believe it's cumin. Most of it's coming through. A little bit of saffron. I'm it's good. You can tell. It's good. But I need a little bit of the spice and the saltiness of the soy. I think that helps it a lot, personally, for me. So this is the pork, shrimp, and mushroom ones. Typical fried girls, I sort of look. So. Really hot, good. It's just been fried. Mm. It's quite doughy, despite it being fried. It's surprising. I thought it would be a little bit more delicate. Oh. <laughs> but yeah, the, the good thing about this is the texture. Um, you definitely need the dip to add the flavour, but the texture of it is fantastic. Let's try that. Um, do you want to go in on this? Give it I'd, a go. I'd rather wait. I don't know how I'm going to react to it. You know, I was quite confident with these two. That's uh, right. Please, please. That's fine. Well, that's us done for today. Try coming here if you're ever in Canada. Take care, everyone.